We've got them, all three, simultaneously at the same time. Craig, at what point did this break down? How big is the difference between GM, Stellantis, Ford and UAW? I think the writing honestly seems to have been on the wall. I think we've, we've uh, for weeks now, known that the union and the, these three companies are far, far apart. Uh, in, in terms of, you know, the, the negotiations, I think on both sides you have, you know, complaining uh, and, and sort of, you know, allegations that neither side is budging or, or you know, going anywhere close uh, to, to sort of the other's direction. Uh, so it, I wouldn't necessarily cast this as a, you know, sort of, you know, break down a sudden a realization that, uh, you know what, we're just not going to be able to do this because we haven't come anywhere close to these companies in this union being able to, to come to agreements on, on new contracts. Auto Guy, what is, this, what is the imagery here or the message from Bronco, Colorado Wrangler? I mean, those are all cool cars for 23-year-olds, right? Is that the message? <laughs> Yeah, you know, I think uh, it's it's both. Uh, these these are cool cars. These are profitable cars. These are trucks and SUVs that these companies count on uh, for serious revenue and profit. Uh, that being said, the the UAW does have some very big, you know, sort of arrows in its quiver uh, to to sort of you know use some imagery here. They do have the F-150 pickups, the yes. Silverados, uh, the Rams, as mentioned earlier, uh, and, and just generally they have quite a few plants uh, to add uh, to these these three f facilities that they're walking out from it, it's really interesting to see the companies uh, you know not know uh, sort of what's next the union is explicitly talking about sort of keeping these companies on their toes and also I think you know the union is is being strategic about you know striking every one of these companies but also in doing it in the selective fashion right. means that they could draw this out and not deplete their strike fund uh, you know too quickly.